So I'm gonna have a bit of a rant now. First of all, I'm gonna tell you how annoyed I am at YouTube this morning, oh my God. Seriously, and loads of people are having problems <laughs> with it. I think it's something to do with a new Windows update. My, um, even though I turned off automatic updates, every time I restart my computer, because I usually just let it sleep, because of the fact that every time I restart my computer, even though I switch off automatic updates and stuff like that, it still does it. <laughs> so I'm gonna, I'm gonna try again. Loads of people are having these problems, but anyway, I'm about to throw it out the window. So this morning, this morning, I went to get my coffee and because I've been in so much pain lately, I have a very short temper, a very short fuse. And so I got there and given the fact that my feet have really bad hypersensitivity this morning and to describe hypersensitivity to you, it's like someone's shoving needles underneath my toenails. So I don't have a lot of patience. So I saw the queue to get my coffee and I thought, sod it, I'm gonna go to McDonald's. I haven't been to McDonald's for ages. I didn't want to. I didn't want the McDonald's at all. I thought it was absolutely disgusting. And as I stood there in the queue, I thought it was disgusting and I didn't wanna be there. And I ordered the food that I didn't wanna eat. And I waited for the food that I ordered all the time thinking of how disgusting it was and how much I didn't want to be there but I was quickly taken off of that train of thought by what I saw and there was this woman who was so big she could have had her own orbit and when my first reaction when it comes to seeing things like that seeing people of that size is not to judge but then I assess the situation and I'll, I'll tell you my opinion on larger size people. If you are of that size, and let me get comfy. Ooh. If you are of that size, I understand that there are medical conditions and I understand that like myself, sometimes people just get fat. But if you are not making a conscious effort to better yourself, recognizing the fact that the size that you are is bad then i can judge you all i want and for me because my first thought is oh she's ordering for her children because she had children don't i don't even know how and i don't want to know why or why or how yeah Ugh. so yeah and i thought she's she's ordering for her children but it became clear very quickly that no nah, <laughs> it's all for her and she could have eaten me but yeah, she was just so big and like I said, I try not to judge people, but she was there ordering her McDonald's and I know I'm coming across as a bit of a hypocrite because, you know, I was in there ordering McDonald's, but my point is that I've lost nearly eight stone and I have a brain disease. Yeah, I'm disabled. These people have no excuses. So yeah, and I'm sorry if you're of a larger size and you're watching this and you're offended, but you know, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to offend you. It's just that it's the fact that people need to be making a conscious effort and seeing that this morning was just absolutely repulsive. So I'm sorry if I offended you, I didn't mean it, but hopefully the people watching this, if you are that size, would agree with me that being that size is wrong. So eh, I'm gonna try uploading this video again now. Time to go for another Waitrose shop. Finally got to Waitrose after some complications today. And this is the haul. The very big haul. This is a very snacky treat shop, this one, because it's Christmas and the offers are really good at the moment. So, tis the season. Sue me. We'll start over the back. All method products in Waitrose at the moment, except for the hand wash refill, are two for five pound. So I took advantage of that, obviously. Fairy liquid, that's the only uh, type of fairy liquid at the moment that isn't on offer, of course. But I really like that one because it cleans plates and stuff really, really quickly. And I find it gets rid of uh, things like tea stains 
in cups a lot better. And then sparkling water, if you're a friend of mine you're probably thinking that's not for her, but actually it is. See I couldn't stand sparkling water and I had this weird thing surrounding sparkling water, I just didn't want anything to do with it. But then I tried this stuff and I was amazed. So I got that to have at dinner because you know water can get a bit boring sometimes and I do drink a lot of water. And some treats. Here we have an advent calendar, a divine advent calendar, because it was, not only was it cheap, but I was a really great mum and didn't get done on an advent calendar in time. Because I thought that I would be able to pick up one quite cheaply, like on the first, and I couldn't. Oh wow, Maggie, that's great. That's just fabulous. Are you serious? Yeah, it wasn't such a great idea, was it? Seriously. Ugh. So yeah, and I could then I couldn't find one anywhere, but Waitrose luckily had some left, and luckily they were the divine chocolate ones, so yay. Uh three oh, three green and green <laughs> green and black chocolate. We have got butterscotch, milk, and orange. Three for five pounds at the moment. Oh yes. See I'm not a big chocolate eater, but I do like expensive chocolate you know good quality chocolate that I could eat till the cows come home and the two lint things were also two for a fiver these are so good for Christmas if you are stuck for like a friend's kid or something one of these they'll be happy but this will probably be my dinner tonight it's a ready pack salad of chicken butter bean salad with roasted paprika potatoes yay because I'm really really tired and I don't fancy cooking this evening so I just picked that up um big Christmas box of uh, biscuits and now for the veg we have got uh, oh I forgot to say as well I they didn't have any of the uh, chocolate mocha itsu rice crackers so I just got the milk ones this time equally as good and oh I got a load <laughs> a load of the bounce balls and in, in other flavors that I didn't try last time and I will do that review later and this one I got the coconut and macadamia like last time. This one is the spirulina and ginseng defense boost apparently. But yeah, so I tried that and uh, that's the almond one. That one is absolutely amazing. It's like marzipan. And peanut. So yeah, lots of them to try there. But they're great to make me eat. Because like I said, when I'm in pain, I don't eat that much. And I have to force myself to eat. So if I've just got one of these in my bag, I have no excuse. So vegetables, we have got, most of this is organic, but the sprouts aren't. <laughs> sprouts, celery, mushroom, broccoli, ugh, lemons, sorry, I nearly fell over. <laughs> lemons, potatoes, avocado, sweet potato, spinach, kale, that's all that's there. Fruit. Two for four pound on blueberries. Love blueberries. For meats, I got some organic chicken breast, some smoked salmon, some pate. Like I said, I mean, I'm trying to be good. It's a reduced fat. <laughs> I mean, it is Waitrose, so it's still going to taste as good. If it was reduced fat from somewhere like, I don't know, Sainsbury's or something, then it will probably taste like ass. But it's Christmas. You have to have pate. Some ready cooked chicken pieces because a tip if you are trying to eat healthily it really really helps to have stuff that's pre-prepared so things like that you can't be lazy with because it's all ready and done and also if you slice up your vegetables like onions or mushrooms and things like that it's so easily accessible in your fridge that you don't really have an excuse with laziness and stuff like that when it comes to making food but anyway preaching <laughs> I'm on all of my diet today, aren't I? I'm terrible. And here we have some bacon because every fridge needs bacon. Some almond milk because it's awesome. And I sometimes I have, when I have coffee at home or tea, I don't tend to use soy, soy milk or almond milk. Almond milk is better than soy milk to use in hot drinks, but I still just have, I have my tea so strong anyway, so I have literally just a splash of milk. Coffee I usually drink black at home but the soy milk that you can get 
in uh, coffee shops is different to taking this cold straight out of the fridge. So, yeah. Uh, cat food, obviously, she has... She's trying this out at the moment. Which is good because it's organic and it's all proper meat and stuff. It's got a decent meat content. So, yes. And then some coconut water, which was on offer. Crusty bread again. And they only had... Don't, I don't usually get organic bread, but that was all they had left. And finally, I thought that I was going to treat myself because all of the desserts are on offer at the moment so I got myself a big chocolate tart what are you going to do? so yeah, that's my waitress shop this time around and I'll be back once this is all put away I'm all dinnered out stuff myself silly with chicken salad and a slice that for me wasn't too big of the chocolate tart Dylan's agreeing with me so, yeah, I'm just waiting for him to go to bed, really. He's yeah. just finishing up his chocolate milk, which is his I protein shake. I've already done. Oh, have you finished? Oh, good boy. So, yeah, I'll be getting him ready for bed. And then I'm going to clean, 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 because that's how I deal with stress. And I don't know how, but since yesterday, my house just seems to have exploded. I think it's because I'm trying to make spaces for homes for things and in the you know the process of sorting everything out everything just looks like a bomb site so <laughs> hopefully once it all has a home it's all gonna look better but it's stressing me out excuse you excuse me